What's up guys, I'm Rasim from RossmerTech.com and this is another tutorial in Swift programming. Now in this class, I want to talk about something called type alias. So let's get started. Now what is type alias? Well, we use type alias when we want to uh, rename or, or ref refer to a data type as a different name or we want to give the data type an alias. So I'll show you what I'm talking about right now. Um, let's say we want to uh, give an alias to the integer data type, right? So uh, I can use the type alias keyword and let's type it up here right before this. So I'm going to hit enter. We're going to type in T-Y-P-E-A-L-I-A-S. This is the keyword for type alias. We're going to hit space. Then we're going to give it the alias name whatever name we want to call the data type. Let's say blue, right? So remember, it's not an integer. We're just uh, giving an alias to a data type. It could be any data, data type. Data types are strings, integers, doubles, and stuff like that. So we're, we already have a data type of an integer here, right? So let's just give a new alias to this int. Let's call, and we're calling int blue now. So we're going to say equals INT, right? So now what we did is we gave an alias name to the integer data type. So now we can refer to the integer data type as blue. So now we can rename this. We can actually delete this and just change it to blue over here. So we're going to type in blue. And once I hit play here, build succeeded and it's still printed out three. So you can use this to give an alias to any data type. It could be a string. Right, sorry. It could be a string. We can give a string. Uh, we couldn't rename a data type to a string. It was not renaming it. We're just giving it an alias. Where uh, we we can use that alias to refer to that data type. So we can just type in that alias instead of the data type. That's all it is. Now, that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys like this video, please give me a like. If you want more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel. I'm Rustin from RustinMartech.com, and thanks for watching.